Thanks for talking to me, Nate. I really appreciate it. What do you want from me now? I just wanted to apologize for last night. I never want to speak of that again. Just let me say it. Ever. Just let me apologize. It just ain't right, Chuck. I just thought it was Darcy sleeping on the couch. I had no idea that was your big fat... What is wrong with you? What horrible thing happened to you as a child to make you like this? Well, from a certain angle... I think some escaped mental patient must have grabbed you and drilled tiny little holes into the side of your head. And it was really dark. And then he filled the holes up with crazy glue to stop the bleeding, and nobody noticed. And I was drunk. Really, really drunk. And my screaming didn't get through to you? Well, sometimes... Darcy likes it like that. You know, it kind of keeps some excitement in the relationship. Try to keep your excitement to yourself from now on. So we cool, bro? Ugh. Okay, just stay away from my ass. Literally, just stay away from my ass. Thanks, man. I was really worried. Um, there is one other thing. What other thing? I think you should avoid Darcy for the next couple of days. What? I know it sounds weird. But she can get crazy jealous about really stupid things. The drill theory is making more and more sense. Maybe they got to her, too. Not so loud. She has this way of just appearing. Did you meet her on Tinder for Demons? What happens if I say her name three times? Darcy. Darcy. Darcy?